26 minutes away from top of the hour and this is Lira Munewa as well as Ntlantla and produced by none other than the man himself that is Black Coffee and it's called We Are More. More they are. More we are. Uh, it's not just the three, it's us as people here as a collective and the more we learn to you know, work with each other the better. Uh, it is the time, of course, uh, uh, for uh, the plug. And uh, the plug is where we feature some of uh, uh, young uh, individuals that are out there doing things uh, to better themselves and establish themselves as uh, entrepreneurs as well as uh, businesses. So we have got our guest, uh, he did give us a very brief profile as to who he is, what it is he does. Uh, Skyroll Twist, Managing Director of Skyroll Twist. And he said that he basically is here to change the game. So do you feel you are changing the game and how are you going about doing so? I think, I think so far we, we're going in the right direction uh, in terms of our marketing strategies as well as how we place ourselves um, in terms of uh, penetrating the market. Um, of course, it's going to take a little bit of time because we're a new player, uh, considering the fact that uh, we are, a, you know, a small company. So, you know, you have to mind every step that you take, mm -hmm. you know. So basically people start new things because they see a certain gap and they see there is a need for what they are going to bring forth to society. So what gap did you um, see? Um, for me, it was not necessarily a gap that I saw. Um, it was one of those given opportunities or okay. abilities uh, because one day I was in the supermarket and um, my light bulb moment ha happened. Mm. And um, for some reason I was looking for this specific juice but uh, I couldn't find it. And uh, I knew that I, you know, I've never seen it. You know, but in my mind I was convinced it's there. Mm. That's how it, the journey started for me. I got home I was like, I need to start working on this thing. And uh, since then, I never look back. Yeah. yeah. Is that in your mind it was there? Could you also taste it as well? Not necessarily. I, I had that um, name, yeah. Twist. Mm -hmm. I had that name, Twist. But at the same time, because of the other brand that was there, it was sli slightly blur. And then when I got home, I was like, how do you bring a twist out of something that is there? That's when uh, Skyroll Twist was born. Um, putting the two variants that are already there, but giving it, uh, which is part of our unique selling point, giving it a similar uh, variant, which is normally would not be part of it. Mm. You know, uh, you're taking something that is foreign or, or not origin to what you normally know, mm. and then you put them together without them, you know, fighting each other on your tongue. Because mm. some flavors, they do that, you know. When you taste it, you, you feel the other one, you know, fighting for your taste, you know, your yeah. taste buds and everything. But in this case, we managed to do well that, you know, both uh, flavors, they need to be calm. At the same time, enjoy them both. Mm. You get to hit by the blueberry first, you, then you hit by the red grape when you drink the Sky Rule Twist. Mm. Yeah. So, and I've got to say that's very true because I, I've tasted both uh, your flavors that you have. And for me, you get to really taste the flavor yeah. and not so much the, the bubbles, the acidity that comes with the drink. Yeah, what we wanted to do, we wanted to also um, make a cross between what um, the market we want to be involved in, that's mm. number one. Number two, we wanted to make sure that even those that are below the age line can enjoy our drink. And uh, we've said from the beginning that, you know, the CO2 needs to be lower than the normal mm -hmm. volume so that you can have a child enjoying our drink without the parent being concerned about it. Yes. Yeah. I, 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 uh, what makes your, your drink uh, different from, uh, I mean, what's your unique selling point? You said, you know, there's an interesting story with regards to this. Is that the story that just relayed right now? Or I have, it, yeah, yeah. Okay. So you had an imaginary drink. Is that what you're saying in your head? I did. You, yeah? I did. It didn't exist. <laughs> it didn't exist. And no. you didn't know this up until you got to the store to realize that actually I'm thinking this. Normally when you go to the store, you would have a list. Um, be a guy, I wouldn't, because I think I, I got it all together in my mind, but uh, you know, then you get to the store and uh, you look for certain items that you're looking for and uh, you start to look and look and look and you're like, okay, why is this drink not here? You know, why is not somebody doing it? And I knew from the start that if I'm thinking about it right now, somebody else out there is thinking about it at the same time. Mm -hmm. So I need to act on it straight on. 
and uh, that's where it started. Any challenges, you know, putting it together? Uh, what was the journey like, you know, in, uh, uh, you know, starting from where you, you started from the store as you walked out and putting yeah. that and actioning that to where we end up with uh, a product here of, of two flavors, yeah? I think that one of the biggest challenges, one, we, we, is to be getting to, to be able to get into the shelves. Mm. Um, the shelf space, we still fight for it. But number two, which is one of the things that will take a, quite a long time to change, um, when you start to talk about this type of a product and try to present to people, because uh, they're so used to your steel juice that are, that can be made in two minutes, you mm. know, and be sold, um, you get people telling you it's just not possible to see this type of a quality product or this product, especially from the black person who's from a t from Tembisa. Mm. You know, you just get every door shut on your face. You know, it's just mm. not possible. Mm. Um, then you get a question of, um, do you have a white guy behind this brand? You know, it's not possible to have this type of quality. Black is not good enough. It's, th it's just not good enough. Mm. You know, up until they do their research, they, then they find out. And then now people they want to get involved mm -hmm. and keep it in mind that just before we go to the can level uh, we started on the bottle where you know i invited a lot of people to participate on the product um most of the people they said no but now they see it in the can they see it going to the stores they want to get involved yeah you know what i mean there's two flavors and yeah. that's it we have two other flavors that are coming in in october mm. because we have to have a full range in able in, in what's in, a full in, range a full range, you, it's either you can have four, you can have six, okay. you know, it's up to you where do you see the level of the range you take it into. But in mm. our case, we still have another uh, white grape with a twist of lychee, which we're going to do. We also have um, a, a twist of pear with a base of ginger and lemon, which is aimed at the mixing mm. market. Uh, that's also still coming up. Mm. So yeah. I see, now I get it, with a twist of another flavor. Correct. <laughs> ah. But the trick Lovely. is, mm -hmm. the flavors yeah. they have to get off. Yeah, like marriage, they have to they have to start dating. Yeah, once they start <laughs> dating, yeah. they have to get married. <laughs> That's a brand. You basically pride yourself on that that yes. the flavors must complement each other. They have to complement each other without fighting. But at the same time, this is where uh, you start to enjoy Scarborough Twist. Mm. Um, you will drink it, and the first time you then you know, taste apple, mm. and then right at the end, as it goes down your throat, mm. you know, you feel something else. Yeah. Then it hits you. Some more twists. Some more twists. Mm. That's where, you know, we're good at. Yeah. Let's talk availability. Yeah. Where can we purchase these? Skyroll Twist is available in independent stores mm. uh, around Gauteng, as well as Kwa uh, uh, Nail Spray. Uh, we've signed BB Cash and Carry. We've signed Spa. It's also coming to OK stores. We are busy with one of the biggest retailers, which I don't want to jinx it. Uh, but by October, I assure you, it will be available nationwide. Anything else that, that we may not have touched on before we say bye? <laughs> <laughs> Just to make sure. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want me to sit here the whole day? <laughs> wow. OK. All right. Uh, so okay, there's one a lot thing, that's still one coming. Thing. Look, um, look. I'm so excited about the product itself and I would really would love people to, you know, to follow us on Twitter as well as on, on, on Instagram to get to know us in terms of the flavors that we're going to develop. We're available online at Skyrule as well as all the media platforms as well. If they cannot find Skyrule uh, at Skyrule online, they can go to www.skyrule.com and they should be able to find all our details. Semi, Semi Mahaule, yes. founder and managing uh, director of uh, Sky Rule Drinks. All the best to you, my brother. Thank you so Listen, much. Listen, I'm, I'm loving the uh, sparkling apple with a twist of peach. I haven't tried the other one. Um, but, you have uh, to try it. You, have to try you know what I like most about it? Yeah. Is that it doesn't have an aftertaste. I dig that. Yes, exactly. Do I you know what? That, yeah? Do you know what? Yeah. That's the process because remember, it took, eight, it took um, 18 minutes, I, I mean, 18 months to develop it. Mm. And at some stage we did have it, but we know what people want, you know, because you have to use real people to be guinea pig. Mm. And then when you say, look, um, this is the product, what do you think? Be honest. And um, unfortunately, your family and friends will always tell you that otherwise. It's good. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. They can't believe. They can't believe. Correct. Oh, my God. Yeah. They yeah. always say it's what good. What is that drink? They always say it's good. Mm. But um, when you get real people, yeah. I think where... I've, I've managed to, to go right was 
I've, when you taste my product, I've always been open to criticize it. Don't be scared. If it's bad, it's bad. Mm -hmm. You know, that's how I'm going to Tell grow. us so we can go and improve it. Mm -hmm. Correct. Yeah. Awesome stuff, man. Thank you so much for giving us your time. Office battle coming up on the other side. 89 110 That's the number to dial if you think you've got what it takes. I think we've got a new champ. Um, I know it was Linda, and Linda was the scop, and now we need to find out uh, who is going to be the challenger.